Remember on the movie news show today when I said I wouldn't react to the Pinocchio trailer? Well, I lied. Well, here it is. Guillermo del Toro is directing a Pinocchio animation movie, like a stop motion animation movie for Netflix that's going to be released later this year. And there's a teaser trailer out for it, but I want to give you a quick quote from del Toro himself that reads, no art form has influenced my life and my work more than the animation and no single character in history has had a deep of a personal connection to me as Pinocchio. So guys, what do you think? That being said, this is something of a passion project of his. Let's just check it out. Mm, there he is. Jiminy Cricket, right? I want to tell you a story. It's a story you may think you know, but <laughs> you don't. <sighs> no, really. That's you and McGregor. You see, I, Sebastian J. Cricket, was Sebastian. There. As a matter of fact, I lived, actually lived in the heart of of the wooden boy. Did he? Pinocchio. Huh. As a teaser? Yeah, that works. December 2022. Hmm. Okay, so I just want to read you this quick quote here before uh, I wrap things up and look at the IMDb uh, that expands a little bit more on that first quote that I saw. In our story, Pinocchio is an innocent soul with an uncaring father who gets lost in a world he cannot comprehend. Uh, uncaring father? Uh, wasn't Geppetto wanting to look after somebody? Uh, hmm, maybe they changed the story, or maybe that is the original story. I don't know. He embarks on an extraordinary journey that leaves him with a deep understanding of his father and the real world. I've wanted to make this movie for as long as I can remember. After the incredible experience we've had on Troll Hunters, I am grateful that the talented team at Netflix is giving me an opportunity of a lifetime to introduce audiences everywhere to my version of this puppet turned real boy. Hmm. Okay. So there's his quote on where his inspiration is coming from. And I think that Gal Del Toro definitely can pull this off. It's got that creepiness to it that uh, I think a lot of people are looking for. It's got his flavor all over it, right? All right, let's go to the IMDb and take a look at exactly who is all in this Pinocchio voice cast. Now we know that's coming out December 2022, right? Okay, so that uh, that was Ewan McGregor, right? Uh, yeah, as the cricket. Okay, so he was the cricket. Kate Blanchett's in it. Um, David Bradley is Geppetto. David Bradley. Okay. Ron Perlman. So we've got some familiar uh, uh, cast members that Del Toro likes to use all the time. Um, and Kate Blanchett was just in uh, his Nightmare Alley. So, uh, okay. John Turturro is in this. Christoph Waltz. Uh, Finn Wolfhard. The uh, cast looks like it's there, uh, at least vocally. Uh, I can't wait to see what the actual doll looks like. They've got some mock-ups here, I guess, uh, some conceptual art. And um, that's what Geppetto looks like. Oof. Wow. Or is that the... That must be the, uh, the, the fair owner, right? Okay, so there he is. There he is uh, traveling the world. And if that's what he looks like, guys, right there. Ooh, that is a bit. Uh, <laughs> ooh, okay, so th there's Geppetto. Okay, so that was the fair master that was before. Um, and that's what he's going to look like. Very Tim Burton-ish, very uh, gothic. It's just, wow, wow. I wasn't expecting that. Um, is there anything else here? No. Okay, so let's go back. What do you think about that little teaser from Pinocchio from Guillermo del Toro? Let me know what you thought about it in comments below and we'll talk about it.